Hey guys, I thought I would just get on and try something before my little got home. It's kind of secret, top secret. Um, something just came in. I just opened up the box. I was very eager for it because um, I've been waiting for like a week for them to come in. And so I thought I would share. Um, these are basically little limited time thing that came out and we have sold out of them. So that's a bummer, but I wanted to share because they're so popular. I imagine they'll come back around. Um, and if you really want one, I can probably find you one. So I'm willing to look and try to help you out. I thought I would show you because they're still a new product. We've only had them one other time. They are so cute. And I think any Easter bunny would be really glad to have them. First of all, they're only a $10 uh, price point and you just need cute little things. So I'm gonna tell you why they're amazing. Um, and you have to be quiet because I think the Easter Bunny is going to deliver some around here. So I had to do it before Colby got home. But there are little bitty babies, uh, bitty buddies, okay? And they come in this super cute little little containers. Everything Cincy does comes in the cutest little packaging. And um, I didn't know what they were when they came out at Christmas time. And I didn't order any the first time. And then they sold out like in 10 minutes. And so they ordered more. And now we have the Easter collection of bitty buddies. And I'm gonna tell you why I love them. Okay, they are super cute. Here is the first one. This is the bunny. Isn't he cute, little bunny? These are fun because they're in all different little pastel, almost like tie-dye pastel. Super precious, so I'm gonna do each one. Okay, bunny. Oh, we had a lamb, a little lammy. And isn't the lammy cute? I love it. So cute. So it's fun too because this one has all different colors, but it's primarily pink. This one has all different colors, but it's primarily blue. And then we have one more. We had a three, a trio of them. This one I haven't pulled out yet. Let's see. Look, they're super squished in because they're squishy. So they're like kind of fun to get out. The little chicky. Look how cute little chicky, which is primarily yellow. And guess what? I have one child, my eldest, whose favorite color is yellow. And I have one child whose favorite color is blue. And I have one child whose favorite color is anything pink or purple. So it's pink and purple and it's perfect. So these three little precious people, I can't hold all three. Uh, maybe I can. Can't, never could, right mama? Okay, three little bitty buddies. They're adorable, aren't they? Now, of course, because they're scentsy, they smell super yum yum. They come scented in rainbow sherbet. Um, and they're about the size of a softball, a little bigger, bigger tennis ball. Um, and here's what's so fun. Watch. They're squishy. It's like a little stress ball and it really is therapeutic. Hey, there's my mom. Hi mama. I'm squishing all my stress away. Who's stressed, right? <laughs> That's why I think that even though my boys are getting big, I've got one turning 17 tomorrow. Uh, the other one is 12 that they still love these because they are they are scented so they smell yum they you can take out some frustrations and they bounce right back to their cuteness um and they're fun to throw because they don't hurt you but it's almost like a little little softball so i love 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 them um like i said if you if you are like oh man i wish i hadn't missed those let me know i'll do my best to track some down um and then just know in the future when bitty buddies come out get them because they're fun for teenagers. They're fun for adults. They're fun for little bitties and they're only $10. So I just wanted to share that before I had to hide them away. Got to hide them away. Um, you know, we got to help that Easter bunny out a little bit. I thought I would wait for Colby for this, but I think I'm going to go ahead and do this too. Um, I think I should show this. I forgot one more thing. Okay. Something else that just came while not a new product, it's a new color option. And again, I don't know if you're like me, but some of you mamas have older kids and it's hard to think of what to get them. If your kids are on their computer all day, like most all the kids, if your kids are um, driving their cars now, oh, these are one of my favorite products. I have one in my car. It is the mini fan diffuser and it basically is tea tiny, has a little USB cord that plugs right in and look at this new fun color. And you remember I mentioned one of my kids' favorite color is yellow. So guess what teenager is getting in his Easter basket, right? So this is the super cute, super bright, fun yellow mini fan diffuser. If you're not familiar, I didn't grab a pod diffuser because I wasn't going to show this off. But I realized I better show it off before Colby's home. 
Um, but you just put the little pod in there and it just blows air over it and it smells amazing. There's been something weird in my car for the last like five or six days. It smells weird when I when we first turned the car on. It's almost like Ben thought we left ketchup in the car. <laughs> it could be with my family. But it smells like it's coming through the vents to me. It's just a weird scent. And as soon as my car turns on, you smell it. However, I have my Scentsy fan diffuser plugged into the USB with pina colada cha-cha in my pod. And as soon as I turn it on, um, I smell pina colada and it gets rid of that nasty smell, whatever that is. I don't know what's happening. So I've got this one and then um, there's a bright pink that I don't have right now. I've already put it away in my secret stash. But here's the bright blue, it's called sky blue. We also have a really pale pink that came out originally and a mint green. So it's the, the pale pink is called blush. Um, and that's what I have in my car, even though I love the slate and I love the silver and there's rose gold, like they're, they're $15 and then the pods are 10. So it's like $25 for this really neat gift. Isn't that pretty? I just love these. I love them because you plug them right in by your, your desk. You can throw them in your bag. They're like hard plastic. You can take them with you when you're like working anywhere. Um, like I said, I love it in the car. It's such a good little gift, great price point, perfect gift for teachers uh, when, when that's coming around here before you know it, right? All right, and then I'm gonna show you one more thing that I may show again with Colby because she loves doing these and I'm cheating because she's at school. <laughs> but I just got this in and I'm so excited. I've been waiting to smell them because we didn't have a way to smell them before we ordered them this time. And I was ecstatic about this collection. So you get to see it first. I haven't even opened them. We have special wax collections from time to time, and this one is so good for spring. Uh, it's perfect for anyone who loves to garden. It's perfect for anyone, who, like a Mother's Day gift, teacher gift, anyone who just likes kind of some earthy or interesting flowery smells. Comes in its own precious little, little bag, and it says, life's a garden. Hashtag dig it, isn't that funny? <laughs> And like everything Scentsy does, the packaging's beautiful. It comes with all the scent descriptions that I probably won't be able to read because I didn't put my glasses on, but I'll give you my review. Okay, so you open it up, and y'all, Scentsy's bars are just beautiful. Look at the artwork on that. This one is apple parsley. I'm gonna smell them, I'm gonna pull them out and then I'll smell them. This one is chamomile daisy. Isn't that beautiful? I love it. Uh, this collection, I believe, is still available. I looked yesterday and it was still available, but it is a limited time, so if you want it, you'll have to order it quickly. Um, I do a monthly uh, subscription box, and it's a mystery box, and um, these are like perfect for that, so I think some people are going to get that. Let me know if you're interested. This is pineapple mint. I love pineapple, so I'm interested to see how that one smells. And my last bar strawberry basil oh that sounds look how pretty i just want to stare at them they're beautiful and this is fun since he puts in a little bag of seeds isn't that neat so it comes with the collection i love it it's got um, basil and parsley seeds that is so neat just a little fun extra so that comes in your bag okay so let's smell these i'm just gonna I love them. Look, they're the prettiest, prettiest bars in the world. I love them. Okay, I couldn't get the fifth one up there. Let's see, which one should I do first? Hmm, y'all tell me, which ones are you most curious about? Anybody? Hmm. I'm gonna start with apple parsley, because to be honest, I'm not sure what, I, I just, I don't know. Am I gonna like parsley? Ooh, I like the color. It's my favorite color. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh, yum. Okay, so I didn't know what to think about apple parsley, but I like it. Oh, it's nice. There's nothing, like sometimes I'll smell things, especially if they're a little more floral and I'm, I'm not a huge floral person. Um, I love fruity though, and this one is just nice. That parsley takes a little bit of the sweetness out of the apple. Mmm, that is good. Okay, that's a winner for Megan. That's in my I like it a lot category. I'm gonna try... I'm gonna try the one I'm not sure I'm gonna like very much. Where are my lavender and violet fans? <laughs> I don't know if I said that one earlier. Lavender and violet is such, they are so popular. In fact, we have a scent called lilacs and violets that's really popular. Um, lavender, violet. I'm not always a lavender fan. The only scent we have that I love lavender in is uh, jammy time. I love that scent. But lavender sometimes smells really soapy. Mmm. Well, that 
it's surprising too. I thought I would not like this one because I don't generally like florals. Mm. Y'all, this is very pleasant. And if you know you like la lavender or violet um, or soft, yummy, feminine kind of smells, you're gonna like that one. I did not think I would like either of those. Now, I hope that doesn't mean I'm not gonna like the ones I think I'll like. <laughs> um, okay, I'm gonna save my favorite two at the end. I think they're my favorite two, we'll see. This one is chamomile daisy. Again, I get nervous about the daisy, but I do have to say I love chamomile and honey in our pet line, so I keep it right here. It's seriously sitting on my desk because uh, we put it on Nala all the time because she is a stanky dog. Okay, chamomile daisy. It's so pretty. Look at these colors. We had green and purple. It's the colors of the rainbow except blue. Well, that one's nice too. Honestly, I thought I was going to dislike this one too. Mmm, that one's pleasant. It's kind of clean and it is not too sweet, not too strong. Mmm, okay. Well, they're doing really good so far. A lot of times when we have a collection of four or five bars, there's usually two that I really like. One I'm kind of in and a couple I'm not as fan of. But so far, so good. Okay, I hope these don't fail me. I hope they don't fail me because I think I'm going to love these scents. Strawberry, pineapple, strawberry, pineapple. Mmm, strawberry. Okay. Strawberry basil. Basil's an interesting scent, so I'll see. Okay, I hope I like it. <laughs> Michelle, girl, did you get any of these? Holy cow, these smell good. Oh my Lanta, this could be my favorite new scent. Oh, that is delicious, okay. Strawberry basil for the win. Like, I love it. I could, I'm could. i gonna just keep it here and smell it again. Okay, now the last one in the collection <laughs> is pineapple mint. I love pineapple scents and I love mint. So this should be a winner. Look how pretty that one is. Pretty yellow. Love it, love it. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my goodness, that is so good. It is so interesting. Like I had to smell a second time. Oh, did they sell out? I didn't think they sold out. I'm pretty sure that I looked yesterday and they were there. I hope you got them too. They are fantastic. And I will need to add some of these to my Scentsy Club. Um, because what happens with Scentsy, oh, those, okay. Mm -mm, I like all five of them. I I would not, t I always tell you if I don't like a scent. I like all five. I think, I think this would be my order. I think this would, if I had a least favorite, it might be chamomile daisy. Maybe, maybe. I really like it too, though. And then I would probably just put these two. I like them both. Oh, and they're pretty, pretty, pretty. And then I think, I can't believe it, but I think the strawberry is going to beat the pineapple. I love this one. And I love this one the most. So I'm going to sit here and smell while I talk to y'all. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Here's the deal, when they bring out limited time wax collections or a bar that's limited, um, like we just had the Lilo and Stitch stuff and there's a bar called Experiment 626, I think. When those come out, you can they're gonna sell out because that's what they do. They're limited and they're such high demand right now, they're gonna sell out. So if you love a scent or think you love a scent or know you love a scent, you can put it in your Scentsy Club subscription. It comes right to your door. You can choose if it comes every month, every other month, or every three months and they will always make that bar for you. So I get a Scentsy Club subscription, and I'm gonna add this one right now if I can, and probably this one, but this one, y'all, is so good. And, oh, I'm so glad I bought some of these. I bought several, because I thought I was gonna like them, and whatever, and then the bag is too cute, super giftable. If you know somebody that you need a really nice gift for, y'all, this is seriously nice. The packaging is on point, the bars are gorgeous, they smell fantastic. And um, you get the cute little seeds, which is just an extra little bonus. Like, I'm in love with this. And, oh, man, I hope I can put these things in my club subscription. It is so fantastic. And, yes, there's a lot of different descriptions. And I could try to read them. But I think I would just look uh, dumb because I can barely see them. <laughs> so I'm not going to do that. But, honestly, if you need some help, you know I'm always here for you. Um, I've got such great things that we have to go hide now because school will be out in about 10 minutes. So i got to go hide those. Um, but anyway, I hope Michelle, you got those cause they are fantastic and I'm going to have, uh, Colby review them when we get home. So I'll probably do that on my main page. Um, I think she's going to like them. I'm interested to see her 
reaction to some of those, but oh man, they are good. So that is so exciting to like all five cents. Um, I will have a few more lives, but thank you guys for watching. Let me know if I can help you, if you have any questions or interested in anything. Um, our Stitch Warmer did, um, like Lilo and Stitch Warmer did sell out right away uh, when it released on Monday, but they are doing a second chance. So if you or someone you know is obsessed with Stitch, um, I'm actually about to place a pre-order for a customer right now and they will be making them. You only have to put down a $10 deposit. Um, you can also get the bar uh, if you want that. I think it's a really good bar. I did not get one the first time around, but I saw a lot of people added it to their club and it was a really popular scent, so they brought it back. Anyway, I hope you guys have a blessed day and I think it's Wednesday, right? I don't know. We didn't have school Monday and it was after spring break and it's messed all my days up, but I'm going to go hide all my little secret things. If you guys need some help uh, for Easter, we still have some great, great things and I would love to help you out. All right. Y'all have a really great day. <laughs> Bye.